Alright, nice math homework is page 41. Today, students learn how to find the area of a trapezoid. One way to find the area of a trapezoid is to use the formula area equals parentheses base 1 plus base 2 times the height divided by 2. So, for example, problem number one, the first base, well, base of a trapezoid is just what it sits on. So, base one would be nine yards. So, I would say area equals nine plus base two, seven. Times the height. This trapezoid has a right angle, so our height is 6 divided by 2. To solve this problem, I would first do the parentheses. 9 plus 7, which gives me 16, times 6. So I'm going to do a little math problem. 6 times 6 is 36, carry the 3. 6 times 1 is 6, plus 3 is 9. So right now I have 96, and don't forget divided by 2. So I can do another little math problem and do 96 divided by 2. 2 goes into 9, 4 times. 4 times 2 is 8, 9 minus 8 is 1, bring down the 6, 2 goes into 16, 8 times, 8 times 2 is 16, I get 0. So my answer is 48, I need to label it, yard is area, so I need my little exponent, circle your angle. Let's take a look at number two. Again, I have a trapezoid, so I'm going to use my formula. So I'm going to use orange for this problem so you can see my work. Um, the base is 11, and we also have a base of 15. My height is 4. So to write out my formula, I could say A equals parentheses. 11 plus 15, base 1, base 2, times my height of 4, divided by 2. 11 plus 15, that gives me 26. 26 times 4, you might need to do a little over problem. And then divide by 2. My final answer would be 52 feet squared. So, do your answer. Okay, students were also taught a second way where they can actually find um, what their trapezoid in half so that they have two triangles and they could find the area of this triangle and then the area of this triangle and add them together. They can do it that way. So for this problem, if I'm going to find an area, I would do, um, for the area of a triangle, we have, oh, so if I was going to do it that way, I would say area equals 
phase time and height divided by 2. So the first triangle, one side is 6, one side is 7. So 7 times 6 divided by 2. 7 times 6 is 42. 42 divided by 2 is 21. So I know the area of this first triangle is 21 square yards. Then I have to find the area of this triangle. Um, so I know the base is 9. The height of this triangle is also 6 because this is my related triangle. So this tells me how high this one is. So my height is 6. So I'm going to do 9 times my height of 6 divided by 2. 9 times 6 is 54. 54 divided by 2 is 27. Now, I know the area of this triangle is 27 square yards. I just need to add them together. So 21 plus 27 gives me 48 square yards. Which is the same answer that I got with my formula. Students may choose to do that either way. So now that I got you started, use your formula. Show me all of your thinking. Circle and label your answers. And go ahead and finish this page.